These days, Joan Bush treasures the simplest moments in life, in sharp contrast to worrying events 10 years ago when a routine mammogram revealed a lump in her right breast. I was sent for further uh, screening at PMH where I had an ultrasound and biopsies and ultimately was told uh, that I did have breast cancer. A lumpectomy was scheduled, but an MRI performed before surgery spotted three more tumors in Bush's left breast. It was the worst day of my life and the best day of my life. Bush has dense breasts, a trait she shares with about 40% of women. The breast tissue can hide cancerous tumors, making them harder to spot on a mammogram. The mammogram is looking for things that are white. And when your breast tissue is more dense, it's more white on the x-ray. And it's very hard to see things that are white on white. A study in the New England Journal of Medicine has found that giving women with dense breasts a supplementary MRI to detect cancer may be more useful than mammograms alone. It involved more than 40,000 Dutch women with extremely dense breasts who had normal results from a mammogram. About 8,000 of the women were also randomly offered an MRI scan. The study found that a supplemental MRI scan was more effective at detecting some cancer. There is no perfect screening test. Mammography does very well for most women, but for the women who have maybe the 12% of women who have the most dense breasts, we call them extremely dense, mammography, its accuracy tends to fall off. And that's where supplemental screening using MRI or perhaps ultrasound can find cancers that would be missed on mammography. MRIs are more sensitive and better at detecting smaller tumors earlier, but they're not perfect. They can also produce false positives. Still, Joan Bush is grateful for the MRI screening she got. They caught it. They were able to treat, treat it. They were able to, I was able to have a, make the decision to have a bilateral mastectomy, and I'm healthy today. The question unanswered in the study remains whether an MRI, in addition to a mammogram, improves survival rates. Cass Roussey, CBC News, Toronto.